Hi Scorpio, welcome to the tarot. I'm going to give y'all a quick little rundown of this and then we will get into the rest of the reading. Thank you guys for all the likes, the comments, the support, the shares even. Um, I appreciate every one of you guys. Um, if you're new, you are very welcome here. If you've been here before, welcome back. You guys rock and I love you. Spirit, help me get clear and precise messages. Archangel Michael, the rest of my team, angels, ancestors, God, block any interferences, block any negativity, return it to center where it belongs. Thank you. <laughs> so, there's a lot going on around you right now. I need you guys to hit that like and subscribe. Y'all know it matters. And uh, thank you. Up top, we got Libra, Aquarius, Sagittarius. You could definitely be dealing with an Aquarius uh, from the past. You could also be dealing with a Leo and Libra from the past. Then you got same sex, text message, friends, enemy, short illness. Somebody could have been acting like they were your friend when really they're your enemy and they wanted to cause a bunch of uh, horrible things for you. This person could be ill or could have a mental illness or a physical illness now um, because of the energy that they put out. Then you also have a friend in your energy and they're going through something uh, really hard right now. You could be having to maybe you're not having to do anything for them maybe you've been with this friend from a very very young age and you've watched them go through loss after loss after loss after loss or death after death after death and you've always stood there to support them you've always been there to support them um this could be a gemini friend um you could be praying for this person you could be praying for their family you could just be watching over them you know um something about that this person this person could be hitting you up with some unex, unexpected information though watch out for that there's a lot of gemini energy in this you also have another gemini watching you i don't know if this is the same gender that you are or if this is an ex from the past but they they watch you it's giving a little bit of obsession um these could be friends family and exes a lot of gemini here so you could just like hold bonds with a lot of Gemini energies. You could also be channeling Gemini or have it in your chart a lot. We also have death watching you again, healing, unexpected change and seduction. Some, you could be sparking somebody to heal, uh, things that are wrong with them. Um, addictions that they have seduction doesn't have to be sexual. This could be drugs, alcohol, PORN. This could be all kinds of things that seduce them into them before I finish up I don't know why but I've literally I've, I've been thinking about this stone so much that it's malachite I've been thinking about it so much that I even caught myself talking about it the other day Scorpio um this malachite could really do you a lot of good right now a lot of Native Americans use it they call it the traveling stone it's supposed to be good for fortune it's also supposed to be good for finances and natives used to carry it with them when they had to travel long distances to keep them safe and to also spark their intuition this is actually the stone that first let me know uh, that there's something about some crystals and rocks that it's actually real and then that and hematite um, a lot of natives wear hematites good for arthritis and bones but when I first got this stone and I'm giving it I'm just letting you guys know because because you're here but when I first got this stone I was actually looking up a good stone for my birthday specifically for my birthday November 16th and I read about it and then I remembered that I had a couple family members that told me about this stone so I went and I bought this and I cleansed it whenever I got home and I didn't know any better, so I just sat it on the nightstand next to my bed. That night, holy moly, I already dream very, very vividly, and I already count on my dreams nowadays, but at the time, my dreams that night were wild, and every time I was thinking I was waking up from that dream, it was another dream, and I would think I was waking up from that, and it was another dream. You see these bands around it? You see how it like starts out and it's like one band and then another band and then another band, another band, another band, deep, deep, deep. That's how my dreams were. So the next night, the same thing. And it happened for probably three nights. And I was like, man, what is going on? Like, why? Like, 
have I eaten anything different? Have I, am I going through a lot of stress? The only thing that had changed in my environment was that I bought this stone and put it right next to my bed, like a foot from where my head was at night. So I looked up, can malachite cause, you know, any kind of like mental, you know, breakthroughs or awakenings or dreams? Yes, malachite is notorious. People use it, if they don't dream at all, they'll use it to help them dream. And if they do dream, it can cause really wild dreams. And now I understand why people used to use it to spike their intuition. But holy, mo if you get some of this for fortune or whatever, and you don't want to have no crazy, 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 intense dreams, keep it away from your bed, at least three foot or something. If you want to use it for dream work, there you go. Do with the info what you will. But it's a great stone that could possibly, you know, shift your, shift your reality. Definitely shift your subconscious. But anyway, then we got trick or treat, marriage, surrender, finances, ending, and long road. Somebody could, somebody in your energy, could be going through a divorce. It feels like you are going through a few marriages. This could be coming together with somebody that you love very dearly. This could also be you coming together with. Um, a job or a reality that you appreciate. You could also be breaking free, as usual, breaking free of some past life karma. This could be last week karma, but it really feels like there's there's like a state of lack from your past life. Maybe in a past life you had to live through poverty and poverty and poverty. You had to live through betrayal after betrayal after betrayal. Something about you shifting that timeline and breaking out of that. It doesn't have to be. Using your free will powerfully um, to pay things off and to end things. Maybe you don't know that you're ending this past life uh, cycle or this past life way. Some of y'all could be getting into like past life regression. Okay. And then um, we got winter cousin, divine timing in the reverse, spiritual awakening in the upright, romantic feeling main male thief and good news we also have gemini again capricorn and uranus mercury and jupiter <laughs> you could be dreaming very very crazy already you could be dreaming a lot about the past or you could be dreaming about something but what you're not seeing is a lot of things working around you to create something very beautifully or you are having to simultaneously work on a lot to create a beautiful moonlight sonata, you know what I'm saying? Um, you really feel like You've been taken advantage of too many freaking times. And it's over. It's over now. At the bottom of the deck energy, we have soulmate. Then we got toxic relationship, wedding. Mystery, roll the dice, legal matters. Something about the law could be very um, important for you right now. You could also be putting forth some kind of evidence or something between the lines, addiction and intuition. Yeah, somebody regrets something not working out with you. So, um, bottom of the deck over here as well, we have timing. So you could kind of feel a little bit in a rush right now. Here's timing, here's that poverty, past life, and mature man again. Wealthy man, high honor, and disconnection. You could, uh, I'm telling you, you could really be getting over past life loss, okay? Um, some of y'all could be getting a message from uh, an older man or about an older man. Unlocking caregiver. 
to spare. Yep, you could also be going through something, either this is in the workplace, in some kind of, uh, in some area of your life, imprisonment, sweetheart, courthouse, you are basically taking on an important role, trying to get justice in a situation accomplished, sad news, mature woman, child. Um, so because energy is fluid, um, I would just like really be sure right now to cross your T's and dot your I's because you could be, you could be having to tell some kind of truth, uh, that you're really not even comfortable talking about, but, it, but it's gotta be done. It feels like it's not just for you. It's for the people before you and the people after you. aid, an idea, you could be getting some kind of message from a feminine, even if you're masculine, because this is all women, if you're a masculine, you could be getting a message, for messages or information, there's that sweetheart energy again, you could be getting messages from many women, Yeah, somebody could have been thinking that they were going to, like, show you or, like, discipline you or punish you or something like that for a temporary amount of time. But then you changed the whole game. Yep, you went on a different way. Because you knew, you knew that they were strategy. You knew that they were planning something and that they were going to curse themselves. So you could have ended that whole cycle. Coming in with text messaging your enemy. We've got blessing and imagination. Fulfillment, well being, enlightenment, variety, fantasy, mind. So you could just be chilling and then get a message from someone that you never expected to hear from again. I don't think that you even really care, but. I just need one. Just need one spirit. Oh, okay. Uh, natural disaster. Risk, frustration, survive. What short illness? Protest. Inadequacy, sue, attention. You could be standing against somebody that was trying to cause disaster in your life. Yeah, stressed you out for no reason whatsoever. What's this change in healing? You also changed the course. Yep, reservation. Because there's other people around you that want you they they can vouch for you they know that you're good at, at, at whatever you they know that you're they know they can rely on you they appreciate you so you you went there you or something about that wow okay um unexpected and seduction with change what is this introvert privacy Separate online community. Mm. 
Yep, somebody could have been a pillow talking about you as well. Something about a vehicle. Some of y'all could be getting a vehicle. What about this? Let's get one more for it. A seduction introvert. Uh, perseverance. Challenge, endurment, resolution. I wanted to fly out in the reverse though, so somebody, somebody could have fallen for something. Instead of getting over an obstacle, they went, here's surrender, ending, and withdraw. Quit, awakening, and rejection. Fright and nightmare. Damn, somebody's going through it. Somebody's going like... But instead of somebody getting over um, their temptation, their addiction, seduction, they could have gone back to it. Yeah. Let's surrender and ending. Libation, donation, pray, religion. I'm telling you, you're either you're already praying for somebody that's going through something. You will be, especially with Pisces energy out here. There's bully. With Pisces energy out here, this is somebody else. And Mercury, somebody else, somebody from your past or somebody since, that you've known since childhood, really going through it. Uh, not necessarily you, but somebody else. One of your enemies, though, is definitely going through a disaster. Um, you're being urged not to engage in it and not to laugh at it. What's a long road with finances? Memory. Remembrance. Communication. R relation or something. Reunion. Hmm. could have fallen off of something for quite a while and now you're picking picking it back up blessing so you could be getting back to a time where you actually were doing like really well indulgence okay illness Be careful in a place of business, okay? We're, we keep getting right back to good news, so be expecting that. What's divine timing in main mail? Withdrawal. Somebody, like, misses you. Damn. Stubbornness, live and learn. Marinette. Um, being controlled and conflict in the reverse so maybe somebody somebody could have thought that they weren't gonna they didn't want to argue they didn't want to debate or something like that maybe they so they got controlled or something like that somebody ended up and then they ended up fighting even more than they ever would have so somebody respects that you don't fight you don't argue you don't you might hit someone with a bottle, but you're not going to stand there and fight. Yeah, Fury's popping up a lot. Okay, what is this? Okay, that's a lot, dude. Friendship. Idea. Aid. 
commitment loss damn okay somebody could be finding out that they were used for money commitment with main mail this thief here strategy somebody could have been trying to steal something and they can't good news and romantic feelings adventure explore passion and travel so there's also a map here it looks to me anyway you could be writing a letter or you could be getting away we're right back to blessing relaxation lonely care okay blind bully damn trap confinement promise so somebody could have promised to stay confined in a situation but it, it was a trap death mask origin Something could be legally happening. <clears throat> Something could be happening legally. So I'm just saying, Scorpio, make sure that you're present. Make sure you're doing whatever you need to do. Some of y'all could either be going to court or you're having to act as your own attorney, basically. Or you could be getting a fucking attorney out. Let's find out. King of Pentacles, Queen of Swords. Motherfuck, man. So there's there's some people from your past that you're tired of even... Yeah, you're going to be leaving that shit in the fucking dust. You've already left it in the dust, but for some reason, something keeps popping up about these people. You also know that something is... Um, something is bound to blow the fuck up or fall the fuck apart because it was built on pain. It was built on falseness. It was built on bullshit. False person, playmate, poverty. The magician, queen of swords. You could have maybe tried to enlighten people like, dude, get a brain, get a fucking life, but they didn't fucking listen. The Magician and the Ace of Cups, though. Somebody could be coming to speak out to you. I will say this, Scorpio, though, and and pay attention to who you're there for during their darkest times. Were they there for you during those exact same times? Were they? Have they returned the support? Because, and I'm not saying this to tell you, like, don't be there for the people you love, but I am saying pay attention because if they wouldn't do the same Harness that energy and use it for use it on the people that would do the same. Now you got a few other people here, and they could be a could be a Sagittarius or another Scorpio, Scorpio Cuspers. They could be Scorpio Libra Cuspers and Scorpio Sagittarius Cuspers. They um they're sticking their neck out and and they're they're helping you. It's coming in, it's coming in with this. What's going on with Scorpio? The world so you could be traveling a little bit farther maybe perhaps to collaborate with people that you feel are yeah brand new beginnings have stability and structure with these could be boss figures knight of pentacles
you're getting good news, Scorpio, I'm watching you. The Knight of Wands. It's a trick or treat and marriage. Page of Wands. Two of Cups. It's the world. Nine of Cups. So you're in a time, or you're coming to a time where you have a lot of options. Ace of Cups. What's the Knight of Pentacles? Someone's friend wants you yeah ace of pentacles and the ace of cups capricorn virgo taurus cancer pisces scorpio cancer pisces scorpio is all in that corner right there so there could be like someone's pisces friend wants you or just someone's friend wants you somebody could be telling you that they could also be telling you that somebody's sick or something What's the Knight of Pentacles? Friends, what's this? Eight of Wands. Somebody's, somebody's, you're about to get some kind of communication, and it could be from either, could be an Earth Signs, Five of Wands, Friends, something about drama, conflict, or something like that. Somebody's also pissed because they know that someone will always have like reservations for you like I'm hearing every light in the house is on and it pisses this person off Imagine being oh my god Night of Wands Three of Swords. Page of Wands. Girl. Two of Pentacles. And the Two of Cups. Four of Wands. Could be putting down money on a property. Ten of Pentacles. Four of Swords. Yeah. The Chariot. Queen of Wands. Now somebody is uh, wounded and pissed and they want to blame you for it and that's not the truth. That's like, that's like you walking in to somebody else's home and being mad because they live there already. <laughs> oh, that's a litter. Oh my gosh. That's literally how it is. That's exactly what's going on here. Three is a fucking crowd, man. So something about an open marriage. Oh. Okay, outcome for Scorpio. High Priestess. Outcome for Scorpio. The Star. The Emperor. So... Your intuition is right about some masculine in power or something like this. Um, you're going to have to... Five of Cups, King of Swords, Three of Pentacles.
Yeah, you want peace, but temperance and the ace of wands could be coming together with the Sagittarius. Somebody could be holding your hand while you have to tell the truth about a corrupt fucking person or something like that. Let me grab another deck. Ace of Pentacles, man. Somebody could have could have been playing with your money and you're standing up for something. You're standing up for that. King of Swords, Aries Leo, I mean, could be an Aries Leo Sag and a Gemini Libra Aquarius. World and the Nine of Cups. Justice, yeah, with the magician. You've watched this person do this. You, yeah, you're having to bring justice into a situation. It's not comfortable. It's not fun. You're kind of nervous. You're scared, but you're basically sacrificing yourself so that other people don't have to go through this. You could also be like publicly protesting something. So again, know your rights and if you don't know them, get someone in your corner that does. I smell bullshit. That's what it smells like. It's the nine of cups in the world. Three of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles, Eight of Wands. The Hermit. You could be hearing from a Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Aquarius. You could be kind of like keeping things or somebody else is keeping things under wraps or something like that. Somebody was like forced to go within because of their actions. Knight of Wands, Three of Swords. Ace of Swords. So you could be telling some kind of truth or somebody else is telling some kind of truth and it's, it's judgment. Damn. Um, page of wands, two of pentacles. Of Pentacles. You could be doing multiple things, uh, working on multiple things, getting multiple things accomplished at once. Two of Cups, four of Wands. The Nine of Wands. Um, be careful about where you're choosing to go because you are going to have to spend a lot of time there. It's a brand new start. You have a long road ahead of you at that place or with that object. So be careful that it's not something that is going to leave you upset or something like that. Be very careful about your decision making, especially as, you, as your money starts growing. Be careful about your decision making. The chariot... Ace of Pentacles, Four of Wands, wow. That, but that is very quick. You may be moving very, very quickly. Be careful about illusions. Five of Wands and the Five of Swords. Drama, conflict, winning energy. This is a, a pretty major time, though, that you're stepping into. Eight of Swords. What's the High Priestess? The Knight of Swords. The 
the star. And the Emperor Scorpio, you're yeah, you're like taking on a major role. And good for fucking you. The High Priestess, the Star, and the Emperor. Four of Pentacles. Somebody lying about something as well. Justice. Yeah, use their power, the sun, use their power to harm you, to hurt you, to manipulate you, and it's about to be exposed, especially, they could do the, they, there's the star again, somebody could be betraying a, a Leo right now as well, and they may not realize it, the star, the three of swords, and the seven of pentacles. So somebody, somebody's about to be put in their place. Somebody's about to be in regret. But they, sh they literally should have thought about that before, before they did what they did. What's the emperor outcome with the emperor? The Knight of Pentacles. You could be getting some good news uh, coming in as well. Maybe you've been waiting for it. The Hierophant. Nine of Pentacles, Queen of Cups. Yeah, you could be teaching somebody how to be okay on their own. Four of Swords, the Lovers, the Emperor. Ace of Cups. Dang. S somebody's like illusions and stuff blocked um a lot of like um water blessings and earth blessings from for, from coming in or something like that but you're not really worried about that anymore you could find out about what a horrible time that somebody has been having having you may be tempted to be like, ha ha, told you so, but just don't, Scorpio. This is a time where you need to remain humble, okay? Remain humble in your professional life, in your love life, in your family life, in your personal life. Remain humble and stay vigilant. Use your better discernment to... Because it's like, whatever you do right now, it's going to have a great impact on something in the future, okay? So, just use use your judgment. Use, use wise judgment. Let's get some advice. Such a curious dream and manage to be glad. That's what I'm saying. You could, you could be like dreaming crazy. I would, uh, I encourage you to follow the white rabbit. I encourage you to uh, dream journal if you need to write it down and break it down and figure out why or why what's going on what 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 messages are you really getting here? You could have a surgery coming up. Maybe you're worried about that or scared about that, but don't be. The advice for Scorpio. Mortality. Life is brief, bright, beautiful, and yours to live. Lead the way. Be a leader. Show others how it's done. You can help others. A lot of black and white here. Okay. Yin and Yang. No need to fear. Remember how powerful you are. So, yeah, this is your energy having to step into um, a leadership position. 
Maybe you're having to tell the truth about heartbreak, betrayal, regret, nostalgia. Find the lesson. Set your course. Know where you wish to go. Have a plan. The right direction. Okay. All right, Scorpio. Somebody could have beautiful green eyes. Somebody could have beautiful blue eyes. That is what I have for this reading. And I love you guys so much. I will see you in the next one. Bye.